You get the call to go in for an interview. You're excited. This is fantastic. You're probably one of six people or so that are getting this call. It's great. So now how do you make sure that you nail the interview so you get to second interviews? Let me tell you. First thing you're gonna do, research, research, research the company. You wanna know everything about that company. So go do your Google research, figure out the latest articles and news releases on that organization so you have a lot of background knowledge. Dig, dig, dig for information because you wanna show that you know everything about that organization. You want to also know as much as you can about the individuals you're going to be interviewing with. So find out who they are. And also, again, do your research on them. Know a bit about their backgrounds and their interests. Okay, second point, you're gonna take the job description that was posted and hopefully it's got some detail in it. It's gonna list all the responsibilities, all the key measurables, the personality traits, and you wanna take each one of those and you wanna actually put an example of where you've achieved it in your career, and it doesn't even have to be in your most recent job, anywhere in your career where you've actually demonstrated that particular skill or responsibility. And you wanna know your accomplishments as well. So what have you actually accomplished? And if that means numbers like sales numbers, revenue targets, profitability, know those numbers, know how many people you've managed to a detail. Okay, once you've done that, write it down. You're gonna go into that interview, you're gonna take a notebook because you're likely gonna be asked to have behavioral-based interview questions. And what those are is it's gonna be, give me an example of a time you had to do this. Tell me how you did it, give me the example and what the result was. So you're gonna have the example, the action you took, the result. So you might forget in an interview all those examples. So write them down. The interviewer is not caring about your examples and where and you being able to remember them. They actually wanna know what you did in the past so they can see what you're gonna do for them. Write them down. Okay, then next step is have some questions ready for the interview. Don't ask questions about money. That doesn't matter at this point. You want to actually ask questions about the job. Ask questions about the company, the job, the role, the future of the company, the five-year strategic plan, the first-year measurables that you're gonna be held to, things that could be challenging for you coming into that role. Ask those kind of questions, okay? Next part, what are you gonna wear? You wanna dress professionally. Often men will say, should I wear you know, a full suit with a tie? It's a casual oil and gas company. Should I just wear jeans? You know what, dress for success. It's always better to be overdressed than underdressed, so dress up. And even if that's a dress shirt and a suit jacket, that's fine, no tie, perfect. Women, wear your suit, your blouse, your dress pants. Look professionally, because it's first impressions are the lasting impressions. So go get them.